against the team in fifth place, West Ham. Ian Rush got one of those goals, his 100th in the league, and Paul Walsh gave another reminder of his international claims by scoring Liverpool's third. By that time, West Ham were down to ten men, Ray Stewart having been sent off when hotly disputing the penalty from which Jan Molby gave Liverpool the lead after 58 minutes. Sheffield Wednesday and Luton, both winners at home today, are still chasing hard and along with Forrest, moved up one place at the expense of Arsenal, who drew at Leicester. Arsenal's North London neighbours, Spurs, lost at home for the third time in eight days, this time 2-0 against Manchester City, and the Spurs fans were quick to voice their disapproval. Manager Peter Shreve, already under terrific pressure, again showed his courage by saying he was willing to meet the angry fans to talk over the crisis. The really testing time could come next Saturday when Spurs go to 3rd Division Notts County in the fourth round of the FA Cup. But tonight, Peter Shreve said, I am confident that I will stay as manager of this club and I am confident I have the total support of the board. The top game in Division 2 saw leaders Norwich beat their nearest rivals Portsmouth 2-0 to go five points clear. A crowd of over 20,000 saw Mark Barham and top scorer Kevin Drinkle get the goals in the last 13 minutes. Wimbledon and Charlton both won impressively at home, but Brighton slipped up by drawing three all at home to lowly Middlesbrough. And not a bad day for the bottom clubs in Division 2, with Millwall, Fulham and Carlisle all winning, while Middlesbrough and Huddersfield both drew with teams in the top half of the table. The only change sees Huddersfield move above Oldham. In Division 3, Reading won't be unhappy with their goalless draw at Blackpool or their 18-point lead. Gillingham move into second place after beating Lincoln 2-0. And impressive wins by Wigan, 5-0 against Swansea. And Notts County, 3-1 at Cardiff, will have done their confidence no harm for next week's cap ties against Southampton and Spurs, respectively. Derby dropped from second to fifth after drawing at Bournemouth, but they've played four games less than the leaders. At the bottom, nothing went right for the clubs in trouble, with Cardiff, Bolton, Swansea, Darlington, Lincoln and Wolves all losing. In the fourth division, Lumakari Swindon Town go back on top after their 1-0 win at Wrexham. The goal came after just two minutes, a Colin Gordon penalty. Chester, who won last night, dropped back to second, while Mansfield stay third despite their defeat at Hereford.